Hello everyone and welcome to the Downseller Studio YouTube channel. My name is Jen. And my name is Riley. And we are here with a Let the Mystery Unravel 2023 into 2024 unboxing. We've been getting these super fun packages every month from Woolen Women Fibers. And we're excited to show you the blanket that I'm making out of them and to find out what this month look like. Every month we get nine very colorful and fun mini skeins that I am crocheting into a blanket of calm um, granny square blanket. And I'm very excited to see what April looks like. But before we dive in, let's look and see our most recent squares and then the other ones that we've done. So what do we have six so far? I think so. Say, and I think we're going to open the seventh month's worth of minis. So let me show you last month's. It's not completely done, so I'm still working on the border. Um, I left the numbers on them. March was a very Irishy, greeny St. Patrick's Day kind of month. I think this is one of my favorites. I really like it. It has a lot more color. Like, it's vibrant. Yeah, and, like, even within the ones that sort of look like they're a little plain, like, there's so much depth of color that it makes it really interesting. So, that is one. Do you want to help me share some of the other ones that we've sure. done? Fun. There's that one. And we've got this one. We've got this one. This is one of my favorites too. Something about this orange that really pops. Mm. It feels very like 70s retro, right? I think this one's my favorite. I can see that. And again, like that bright pop of the pink really just like makes that square. Um, the pattern doesn't necessarily call for putting a border around each, but I thought it would be fun to really know each separate month together. So instead of just putting them all together, um, yeah, and then it kind of feels like each month I have a little finished object, so makes it kind of fun. Very satisfying. All right, let us see what we have for April. Ooh -hoo -hoo. All right, so first we start with our theme for the month. Um, the way that this works is every time you finish a square, you can go ahead and scratch off one of these clues because we're revealing mysteries to go along with the Nancy Drew computer game. So the theme for this month is Trail of the Twister. All right, Nancy's postcard says, Dear Dad, you won't believe the adventure I'm getting up to next. PJ Kralmeister has hired me to investigate a series of equipment meltdowns that have been plaguing the prominent Oklahoma Storm Research Team. His team is expected to win a million dollar grant, so there is a lot at stake. I will be going undercover as an intern to investigate. Time to get sleuthing and get to the bottom of this. Love, Nancy the Knitter. All right, so let us see what our colors are for this month. Will we do them in order or will we just pick them up? What do you think? Um, there's an order? Well, they're all, each of them is numbered. Oh, gotcha. Um, we can do it in order. Okay. Let's find the order. Yeah. All right, are we ready? Yes. Number one. So, number one is this, like, I feel like it's lavender. Yeah, I'd say lavender. It's like a lavender color. Then number two is more of like a like a minty green, I think. Yeah. Uh, it's not picking up all the green on the camera, but it's a green. And then number three, I don't know what you would call uh, that's that. Color. That one to me reads like a nest, like a bird's nest Ooh, kind of thing, yeah. like a twig. I can all see right, that. then four is another kind of greeny one. There's real bright pops of that, like yellowy green that down next to yours. Then number five, ooh, is a beautiful blue. That's really nice. And then number six, we are back to green, but this one's got some browns in it. It's feeling very springy. Okay, what do you got next? Number seven is like this pinkish brown color. Yeah, it's a little like more a peachy maybe. Peachy. Like a mauve? Yeah. Then we have number eight, which is like a bright green. Really pretty. Mm -hmm. I think green's a the theme. I think so. And this one's like a peachy yellow. 
Yeah. Oh, yeah, I like that it has both colors mixed in. Yeah. Cool. All right, let's see if we can hold them all up together. <laughs> you got those ones? Yeah. Let's fill the screen a little closer. Fun. Oh, this is going to be another good one. It's going to be really bright. All right, and then along with our mini skeins, we also get a progress keeper or two from Sam's Tiny Trinkets. Do you want to show them the little envelope yes. that comes in with that? Do you know what that thing is? The wax seal? Yeah. Okay. What's the patterning on it this time? I can't tell. It's so hard to tell. We An keep... animal? A bunny? Oh, yeah. It's a bunny with like a little wreath around its neck, I think. It's so pretty. It is so pretty. I can't even open it. We don't have to open it if you don't want. There's just some information about Sam's Tiny Trinkets in there. Gotcha. All right. Now we have our Sam's Tiny Trinket. Oh, my goodness. Look at Nancy. She's like ready to be an intern at the factory. Does she have overalls on, yeah. And then she's got like a little friend. What do we think it is? Like a little teddy bear, a mouse? Maybe. It has teeth though. It does. Is it a bunny or a beaver? A beaver? I don't know. It's really cute. It'll be in your clues. I know. Maybe it will. Where did I? I lost the postcard. I don't think it says anything else on here. Well, it's some kind of animal of the trail that lives in Oklahoma, but is adorable. I love that there's always like this little jewel. See in her, her little overalls there. Oh my goodness. Let me give you one more look at that little guy. What do you think he is? I don't, I don't care either way. I think he's a fun little, he's cute. A fun little animal. Yay. And I like that she has like little braids this time. Ooh. It's different. Is that less? No, that's not last month. No. Oh, do I not? Oh, I didn't put last month's on. That must be the month before. Um, yeah, but look at like how it's amazing, again, with such a small little canvas to play with, like how much detail she gets in. And like, it always looks That's like Nancy, crazy. but she always looks a little bit different. Like every month she really like goes with the theme. So woohoo, we got to get winding up so I can cast on my squares for this month. And yeah, that is going to do it for this month's Let the Mystery Unravel. This kit is not available anymore, um, but Woolen Women Fibers does really fun kits. If you've seen, I recently put up the May box, which is available until April 22nd. So if you're watching this now and you want to go watch that unboxing video, it was the Woolen Camelot themed yarn box from Woolen Women Fibers and it was so fun. It you was, watched that video, right? Yeah, I watched it. It was really it was really cool. Yeah. Did you have a favorite part of that kit? Um the yarn. The yarn. Yeah, the yarn is beautiful. I've started socks with it already. Um, it's really fun. So the the really the, the stuff that they come up uh, come up with is so clever. It's um a mother and twin daughter team. So it's a women owned family business doesn't get better than that, right? So check out that video. I will link that down below as well. And we will catch you again in the next one. Thanks for watching. Bye. Bye.